Hey guys, what's going on? Dusty here from All Around Performance. Doing another video here on one of our QJ Motor motorcycles that we have in stock. This is actually a scooter. This is our model LTR 150. This scooter actually has lots of technology in it that I'm actually quite surprised that it has. I'm going to walk you through everything and kind of show you the do's and don'ts and go from there. So it does have a real nice comfortable seat. I think that's one of the first things that I noticed. I'm going to stand on the other side here. That the seat does have really nice stitching into it. Very comfortable. You can see that it's got a, it's got a real nice step down here so that it holds you in. Passenger seat, including the foot pegs, if you push this in and you let it out, it goes out. And if you want to if you want to make it stay, you just go in a little bit or you go all the way in. If you try to go all the way in like this, it does not stay. It took me a while to figure that out, but you know I figured it out. So up here in the front, let's take a look here at this digital dash. Let's get started with that. Let me keep going here with the switch. Digital dash, it's kind of nice. It kind of tells you everything you want to know. Your miles per hour, your distance, your time. You've got all sorts of different sensors on here. It's got headlights, charging signals, horn. It does have the electric start button, the kill button, and this one right here is super, super cool. This has got a automatic start and stop. So every time you come to a stop or a red light, this machine, if you have this down, will turn off when you come to a stop, just like a golf cart. When you come to a stop, it shuts off. But when you turn the gas, when you turn the throttle tube, it allows the thing to restart and keep going. So that's a super cool feature. I'm gonna take notice here of the headlights as you work your way around the front. It's got turning signals here below the brake levers. The dash, not the dash, the headlight here lights up. It's got that cool illumination. Turning signals built right into the front, front fender flares. Front and rear brake rotor. This machine, you'll notice, is set up right now currently on a kickstand. This thing goes all the way across the scooter. That way it's completely solid. You ain't got to worry about it tipping over. And it also has the flip-down kickstand. Let's start out with a couple of these features that are right here underneath. You notice it's got nice deep storage. Somewhere you can hang your keys or a purse. Another little bit of storage. You notice this key functions as two separate things. Take a look at this key. That's awesome. Yeah, it's hard to see, but it's kind of keyed out. It's kind of cool. It's also got this built-in. It's also got this built-in key that goes right in here. Sorry, guys. And when you rotate this, this is kind of cool. See if I can get it where it needs to be. You take a look at that hole. Look at it covers that hole up. Keeps the moisture out. Nobody can stick a screwdriver in there. You don't have to worry about anybody busting your stuff. Also... If you switch this thing up to the open position, you notice the second one over is open and you push this button, you hear it click, it allows the seat to open. And then when you open the seat, huge storage compartment here, you can throw a helmet in there. And as you work your way across, that's where your gas tank is. Okay. If you guys have any questions on this model, if you want to see something that I didn't show you, if you guys want to FaceTime me and you want me to walk you around and show you some details on this machine, you guys are more than welcome to reach out. Financing is available. Current rates do vary depending on when you watch the video. If you guys are interested in financing this unit, obviously we do that. If you're interested in trades, we accept all trades. Even if it's running or not, we have a large salvage company, so if you're ever looking for used parts for a motorcycle, on-road or off-road equipment, take a look at our website for that. And keep in mind consignment. If you've got a motorcycle you need help selling, take a look at our website. we got quite a bit of consignment vehicles on there. Feel free to reach out. Anything you need in the sport, we've got it. We appreciate you guys watching. We'll see you on the next one.